Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome back to more of the Advanced Wars 2 War Room. Today we're going to go to Pivot Isle. And because we've been uh, working with the Black Hole CEOs a lot recently, we might as well as go ahead and do the last one. So we're going to be picking Flak today. Not sure how Flak's going to do here, but from what I remember this is a pretty standard map, so it shouldn't be that bad. Our opponent is Eagle, who we were before. His advantage is obviously going to be his flying units. Flak has a very distinct advantage, which can actually end up being a disadvantage for him. Basically, whenever he uh, tries to attack an enemy, or sometimes even receives damage from an enemy, sometimes he'll either do more, or sometimes he'll even do less damage. Kind of depends on a luck factor that his character is based around. So, some days he can have good luck, other days he can have bad luck. It really just kind of depends. But let's uh, go ahead and get things started here. I think we're actually going to uh, start with building an APC and an infantry, so we can get kind of moving here as quick as we can. We want to get this uh, base as soon as possible. So let's go ahead and start that. Let's. Uh, I'm an APC, infantry, and let's just start with that. Why not? Of course, he is going to start with a T copter, so he's going to go straight for this land over here. That's not really going to be a surprise. It's Eagle. He is going to take advantage of that, whether you like it or not. Um. Let's see, should I go ahead and build something? Actually, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and actually build an anti-air. And to balance it out, we'll just build an infantry. We have an APC already, we'll just come back and get it. Yeah, let's uh, keep going. He's probably going to build a B-copter here. Yep. Just like I figured. Okay. Well, we can probably deal with that. I'm hoping anyway. Let's just start and uh, keep moving here. You want to build anything else? Well, hmm. Yeah, let's uh, get a tank unit going too. And we'll just leave it at that. Pretty sure, yep, he's going to go for the base first. We want to make sure that we can actually get to that airport on the middle island before he gets there, because we want to have an air force of our own. That is going to be the uh, biggest determining factor, I guess you could say. Also, you're probably going to head towards my APC, whether I like it or not. Oh, there's also an airport down here. I guess I didn't see that. Well then, that makes things a little more bearable, I think. Okay, here we go. Um, let's go ahead and build another anti-air, because they're pretty good against infantry, and we have a lot of infantry to deal with. Obviously, this is a uh, this little section right here. It screams choke point. And that's pretty much what we're going to do to actually uh, take care of all these guys that are coming through. We're going to create a giant choke point of sorts so we can uh, make sure they don't get through. And then while we uh, keep things on uh, watch in the center here, we'll focus on uh, getting that center island because that is going to be the biggest problem. Okay, well... I'm going to go ahead and start capturing you. You. I'm not too worried about stuff down here. I want my tank to be fine, though. Actually, yeah, let's build another anti-air, just so we're covered. And then I'm just going to kind of block this guy. Okay, cool. 
exactly what I wanted to do. Just wanted to keep away from that airport for right now. Although I have a feeling... Oh, nope, didn't do it. Didn't do what I was actually expecting him to do. I was kind of expecting him to load the APC and take it up here to that airport, but no, he did actually, uh... He didn't do that. Which surprises me quite a bit, actually. Well. I think we're pretty good for right now. Let's go ahead and start moving these guys forward. Actually, I'm going to make sure my tank's safe here, so... We'll leave that alone, and I think I'm actually going to build an artillery. Because again, we're working with choke points here. Artillery are going to be the, uh... One of the two units that'll be very advantageous for choke points. Okay, that's alright. I'm just going to go ahead and join these guys. You're going to... Ugh, that doesn't do a lot of damage. Don't really have much of a choice, though. Yep, let's go for it. Wasn't crazy about that amount of damage, but it's kind of too late for that. It's pretty good, though, because now we can actually get some uh, flying units out in the open. Don't think we have to deal with any fighters yet, so we're still okay there. And I can also build another tank, too, so... This isn't going too badly. I'm behind when it comes to the center island, but... I'm also doing better down here than I expected I'd be doing. Which, hey, that's alright with me. Okay, well... We can kind of clean up over here. I don't want to put my, uh... Okay, good. I'm glad I checked that beforehand. You are going to... What should we attack with him? Probably you. And you're just going to do this. Do this. Kind of hoping I could have moved over one more space, but that's fine. Oh yeah, I can use my... Okay, I can use that. I'm not doing as uh, bad as I thought I was there. Okay, well... Another good thing is I have this I can use to refuel. That's nice. I think I'm actually going to go for uh, another artillery, actually. Again, that's going to be very helpful right here. I'm almost wondering if I can actually sneak through here and uh, grab the capital before they can do much, but that's kind of uh, stretching it, I think. I don't think I'm going to be able to get that lucky, unfortunately. So I guess the better option would just be to save my gold for a uh, possibility of a bomber or a fighter. Well, definitely both. Oh boy. Oh, it's only a lightning drive? Okay, that's uh, kind of lame for you. I don't know if I actually would have done that, believe it or not. But I do need to kind of be careful here, and I actually have an idea. Oh yeah, this will actually work out pretty well, I think. So what I'm going to do here is I am actually going to kind of sacrifice my uh, B-copter, but I'm going to do it in a way where it's going to be very beneficial for me. Because, now that we have this choke point kind of figured out, we can actually throw caution to the wind a little bit. You need to watch out for you, though. 
So let's go ahead and move you right here. Combine you guys. And there, this way, if uh, this guy attacks my B-copter, I'll just destroy him with this and I'll still have a somewhat healthy B-copter around that they can actually do some damage with. See, it's about taking little scenarios like that and using them to your advantage. That's essentially how you play Advance Wars. Oh, and thank god I didn't screw that up either. <laughs> that would have been pretty, pretty terrible. <laughs> So I'm going to bring you here. That way I can start capturing both of those. Now I can, uh... I can actually get a fighter. I'm going to go ahead and do that, actually. Let's get a fighter. I don't think we're in dire need of any other units at the moment. We have our nice little choke point, and we have some other units that will take care of everything else. That was actually the worst place for the, uh... uh Damn it, I actually should have thought of that. Actually, wait, can I move my fighter there? Ah, oh, dang it, just one space short. That's okay, though, it's okay. I can uh, prevent this from happening right there. Okay. Yeah, I prevented that from being captured, which that's all that really mattered anyway, so. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Kind of have to be careful here, though. So, what I'm going to do here is I'm going to kind of bring you into the fray. Okay, yep. I think that'll be a good idea. Then we can start capturing this. I can also bring you over. That'll definitely, uh, Make some good things happen. And now I can actually focus a little more and breathe a little easier. I hope. Breathing is one of those things that sometimes you just don't know if you'll be able to do that or not. Uh, let's get a B-copter and leave it at that. Maybe I can get a bomber next turn. Hopefully, hopefully. Okay, well, kind of figured that would happen. Oh, wow, why did he do that? That was kind of a stupid move. He moved his uh, rocket out of the way. So now I can prevent both of these from... Uh... Actually, I can't because... Well, I can. I have to use my CO power, though. Which may or may not be a good idea. Hmm... Also, yeah, we have this guy coming up, too. Okay, I have an idea. I have an idea. Oh my god, this didn't work out the way I thought it would. Also, damn it, he's covered. You're not covered, though. Oh my god, it's not doing the amount of damage I want it to. Uh... Well, first, let's capture these. I'm going to send you here just in case I might need a reinforcement up here. Um, as much as I don't want him to get that, I'd rather him get that than get this. So... I finish you off. Surely I can do this. Thank you. Thank God. I still didn't get my CO power though. That's kind of annoying. That's quite annoying actually. Yeah, let's get a rocket now. Actually, this might actually be better anyway. Boom. Boom. There we go. Making some room. Yeah, I think we're good. 
Okay, let's see what's gonna happen here. This way, next turn, I can actually use my uh, Super CO power. He's only using his normal one, though. Which, hey, I approve. I like that better than his Super CO power, that's for damn sure. I think that does make his air units a lot more powerful, though, so we need to be careful. Should I go ahead and try it, or should I wait till I have a better chance next turn? I'm almost thinking next turn. Yep, I think that will be the agreed upon strategy for right now. you over here. Kind of wish I could do more with you, but I think you're pretty much dead now. So let's get you out of the way. And they can start attacking this. Hmm. Should probably leave that open though, just in case. Also, yeah, I need to get this guy over here too. Uh, I'm gonna send you up here to start capturing. You can start healing. Actually, you can stay right there. I don't think I can move there. Wait, can I? No, there's no square there. Okay. Yeah, I can leave you there. One, two, three, four, five. Unfortunately, I can't use it until the turn after this. It's alright, though. It's alright. I got some damage done. That's all I needed to do. I'm not going to destroy you, though, because I don't want this tank getting hurt just yet. Now let's uh, build another B-copter. Maybe next turn I can actually get a bomber. Oh god, there comes B-copter. Oh god, can I uh, get hit by that? No, I can't. Okay, I'm just out of range. So, let's go ahead and uh, use his Super CO power. Grawl! <laughs> yes, Flack, Grawl. That's exactly the phrase we need to be hearing right now. Because Grawl. Okay, well now, let's see. What can we do? Well, first... Yes! Alright! We got the good Barbaric Blow. I think it's still pretty much random to how much damage it does or can do, but actually, you know what, I'm going to do this because that is going to be good for right now, keeping that blocked off. As for you, hold on, am I in range? No. Perfect. Thank you, thank you. This is going pretty well. I'm gonna I'm gonna admit this is actually not going so badly. I'm actually gonna do this because I wanna make sure this guy can hit as much as he can. That is what we're gonna need. As for you I don't know, one HP B copter, I think you're pretty much screwed. There's like not much you can help with. Yeah, there's not much. I probably should have joined these two just so I could get some more funds out of it. Okay, that can't be captured, so let's go ahead and kill you, get rid of you. That'll uh, save some time. 
And yep, I can get a bomber, so let's do that. Let's get a bomber, and I'm liking this. This is going pretty well. Choke point still holding up nicely. Working on kind of getting in here a little more. Exactly what we're supposed to do. All right, let's keep going. In before things go horribly wrong. As we know, that can always be a possibility. My god, though, that he's being really embarrassing with this. Okay, well, I can probably finish off Mr. T-Copter. Good, good. I can hurt you. I can hurt you. Yeah, let's hurt you, let's hurt you. And I can also bring Mr. Bomber in, too. Mr. Bomberman. Because Bomberman drives that plane. Okay, well, you know what we're going to do next? We're going to open up this. I can also harm the rocket, but I'm actually going to wait, because, uh... Okay, good. Hmm. Okay, let's do this. That'll work. Yeah, you're gonna get hit if you do that. You're not, though, so I think I can keep that going. I might want to bring this tank forward, maybe. But for now, let's just go with another B-copter. See, this is really cool. I like the way this is going so far. Okay. He moved the fighter for or the B copter forward. That is gonna cause some problems, but that's alright. That's alright, we can deal with it. We can deal with it. Oh wow, I could really Actually, you know what? I He is such an idiot sometimes, because I can just do this. And I'm actually covered. <laughs> wow. I can actually do this, too. Oh, wow, that didn't actually do anything. Oh, that's okay, that's okay. Because we can do this. Let's just uh, kill you. Kill you. And now we can actually start capturing this, and next turn we can capture the uh, airport, so we are making a load of progress. So very much progress. I have to step away from here, though, because Mr. Uh, anti-air over there is like, no, can't let you do that, Star Fox. And I can't really get my bomber in yet, either. Now yeah, that kind of sucks. Actually, is there a shore here? Cause I, oh, no, no, that won't matter. Okay, yeah, I guess I'll just leave that alone for right now. It's cool, though, because I have, uh bunch of air units down here now. I might actually want to start building uh, ground units again. In fact, yeah, let's let's build one ground unit and not a T. Yeah, let's get it. Okay, let's get another B copter. I thought about bringing a T copter, but it's not safe for that yet. Not quite. We're getting there, though. We're getting there. Oh, wow. They are just frickin' being stupid now. I don't know what they're doing, but... Well, actually, that's not too dumb. It looks dumb, but... 
We still have some ground to cover. We gotta give him a little credit, basically. Yep, I'll give you a little bit of credit for this, because this was actually pretty smart. I can hurt you from there. Let's keep going. Let's do this. Let's destroy all these guys. I'm not really sure what this guy is going to be able to do. Maybe he's drunk. It's probably exactly what it is. I don't like these two bee copters, though. That's the one thing I'm kind of nervous about. The one thing. Everything else, though, it's like, man, eh, whatever. I'm ca oh, damn it! I meant to cap. Well, I can start that next turn. Yeah, let's do that. You still can't do anything, can you? One HP B copter. You're so useless to me right now. I hate saying it, but it's true. Okay, as long as we're not next to the shore, we're fine. Which means we can actually park ourselves right here. Huh. No, I'll, I'll just leave you here. And I'm actually going to get another fighter, because we do have more uh, B-copters to deal with. It's these guys that are throwing me off. Oh, damn it! I did not think about that. Well, you know what? That actually did help, believe it or not. That helped because I brought those B copters away. Or brought them away from the B copters. I have a little more of an issue here, though. Oh well, I can recover from it. I can recover from it, it's recoverable. In fact, I can probably even use my power, but. Before I do, oh damn it, this is actually a lot more, um, what am I trying to say, it's a lot more jam-packed than I thought it was going to be, which kind of sucks, honestly. That's okay, that's okay. I have, uh... I have a few things at my disposal here. Actually, yeah, I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna get rid of you. And bring you up here, because I need fuel. Then I'm just going to kinda... Do more of this. Destroy you, bring you over. Okay, I'm feeling a little better. Still wish I wouldn't have made that rookie mistake, but... Too late for now, too late, I already made that mistake. Um, you can't do anything. So what I'm actually going to do here is to prevent these guys from getting through. I'm just going to put you here and, uh... I can, they can still get through. Well, no you can't. You know why? Because stuff. I know, that still doesn't take care of that guy, but we have a fighter, so if he tries to push through, he'd be an idiot. And we could actually use an anti-air, so let's bring that out. And let's go from there. Okay, that's pretty cool. I like that. 
Wait, is he gonna use... Yep, okay, he's using Lightning Strike, which is not good. Damn you, Lightning Strike, damn you! Ugh, shoot. Well... I lost a... well, I only lost one unit, so that wasn't too bad. Yeah, that could have been a lot worse, honestly. Let's, uh, focus here. I need to heal you first, so I have you back in commission. Then I need to take care of you. It's not much, but it's something. That did not finish you? I guess you are in frickin'... Well, you know what? Let's get rid of this guy, finally. Let's just leave him here and get him out of the way. He's not really helping my case, anyway. Boom. Surprise that actually did enough damage, but again, no complaints. Boom. Okay. Got that covered. I have another airport. Capture you. Get you healed up. Good to go. Then, next turn, I can actually, uh, you know, do the uh, super power thing. Because I don't know what, what else to call it, so I'll just call it the super power thing. Ouch. I need to pay attention to where I have all my units. It's getting to that part in the level where it's just like I have so many freaking units that. Like, it's just hard to pay attention to all of them. So as a result, I start getting careless and start frickin' hurting units that I shouldn't be hurting in the first place. I hate when that happens. I hate that part of the map. Actually, hold on. I should be using this. I know it has a possibility of being worse, but... I don't care. I need to use this. If I want any chance of winning this map, I need to use my powers. Okay, well that worked out. Also, let's, uh... Oh, yep, there was a possibility right there of the uh, power getting stronger. Also, you did a lot of damage, but I can see why. Let's see. Let's, uh... Okay, that works. That works. Get the B-copter in. Get you over here. And then get my capture force going. actually do the same thing with this over here, having another APC moving forward. It's good to have multiple uh, variations of that. For now though, we need to uh, get you guys out of the picture. I know I'm probably going to lose this guy as a result, but I don't care. Yeah, let's get another bomber. 
and a recon for no reason. Power to Mario would be proud of me. He loves recons. Ouch. Why did you skip the tank? I'll never understand you guys sometimes. I'll never understand you. I'm thankful, don't get me wrong, but... I still don't understand. Okay, let's, uh... Actually, I have a bomber. Why, don't, why am I not using that? Boom. Boom. There we go! That thing's blocked off now, finally. That was causing some annoyances. Quite a few annoyances. Oh god, I didn't even notice. He, uh, well, you know what? Aha! Can't get through. See, I'm glad I actually did that. I seem to have created kind of another problem, though. My choke point here is no longer choke pointable. It's okay, though. It's okay. I'm gonna get some more money. And I'm just gonna push through. I'm gonna push through with whatever I have. Build some more units, I'm gonna build some more units, okay? That sound like a good idea to you guys? I thought so. Okay. I might lose my artillery. Nope, nope, I didn't. Perfect. So, with that being done. Start getting rid of these guys. Yep, let's do this. I like, I like, I like. I'm not sure what to do about this frickin' uh, lander. Honestly, the lander's not gonna be too important. It's not gonna be able to do anything. I mean, come on, let's be real. Yeah, I need to get through here somehow. Well, there is something I can do. Let's try it, I guess. Uh, can you please maybe, uh, kill this guy one round? Nope. Really? Gonna be that kind of guy, are ya? Well, I have a plan anyway. I'm gonna cover up these for now, and then next turn he's not gonna have an Air Force ever again. Because all of his Air Force units will be wiped off the planet. That's going to be pretty good. Let's get another bomber, and I think we'll start to see the ending of this now. That's okay. In fact, that actually kind of helped me out. Because now that we're done with that, we can actually start causing mischief kind of mischief I want to cause. Let's get you out of the way. Bring you forward and almost get rid of you. That's fun. 2 HP tank is not really going to do much. Oh, I can use you too. I didn't even see that.
This guy is going to be a problem, but in terms of uh, routing everybody, not in terms of threat. I mean, come on, it's a freaking lander, but landers can be kind of annoying if you're trying to win by routes. Okay, it looks like every unit is damaged now. So let's uh, bring these guys forward and look for openings to deploy our units and we'll be pretty good. Oh, there's another bomber too. Forgot about that. So yeah, looks like it's going to be the length of uh, Seoul Harbor, but at least this one was a little more action-packed than that one was. Ouch. Ouch, ouch. Well, I didn't die. That's a good part, didn't die. That's always a good thing. Also, let's just get rid of this guy just to get him out of the way. Yeah, that was probably better I did it that way anyway. Thank you. Thank you. I think I actually can do this on this turn. If not, I'll be really, really, really damn close. Like, painstakingly close. No, wrong unit, wrong unit. That's who I meant to use. Yeah, it's gonna come down to one guy. Well, no, 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 I think I got this. I got this anyway. There we go, there we go, there we go. Nice, alright. Well, guys, that was Pivot Isle. That should be... Eh, it's an S rank. It's could have done that a little bit faster, I agree with that. I probably could have uh, gotten a transport copter in there with a the unit, but eh, that's fine. That, that was pretty good. Uh, Flap worked out pretty well. I didn't really have any uh, major problems with him, which is a good thing. That was actually one of the COs I was dreading using. So yeah, there we go. That's Pivot Isle. Uh, we'll go ahead and see what's up next, and uh, then I'll close it out. I think my high score here is actually 999 anyway. Oh, nope, nope. I beat this with max. So I'm only three points more, so... I did it in 19 days, though, so... <laughs> yeah, I, w I was a little faster, I guess you could say. But yeah, that's going to be it for Pivot Isle. I'll see you guys next time when we do Land's End.